Good morning. Today, we are going to look at some options with the Opera browser to kind of customize it for your classroom or school. What we are going to do is begin on the home screen of the Android browser. We are going to select and open up the Opera browser. And as some of you have reached out to us, we are realizing that some of the ads that you may be seeing are not really school appropriate. So what we are going to do is if you look across the very top of the page where your tab is, you will notice on the far left-hand side, there's a little person icon. We are going to select that person icon and it's going to pull up some information for us. What we are going to do is select the settings wheel. When we select that settings wheel, it's going to give you some options. First is you want to make sure that ad blocking is turned on. Then as we kind of scroll through, we want to be able to see startup. Startup, you want to choose continue where I left off. When it is starting up or has been left off for a while of inactivity, you don't want it to pop up new tabs. You want it to continue where you left off. This way, you know that you probably were on an appropriate site for your classroom, and that way you can change when needed there. So again, under startup, we're going to continue where I left off. Your home page. Here is some things that we want to make sure with the home page. For your suggested sites, it most likely is checked. We want to uncheck suggested sites. Under news, reader mode, language, interests, we are going to turn this off. Turn off the news. Opera notifications, we don't need opera notifications. We can turn those off. Again, when we come down here to search, we do not need suggested sites. We don't need trending searches. It's fine if you want to leave on your recent searches because most likely it is items that you are searching that you need for your classroom. When we continue to scroll, it will show you where do you want items to go. So if you are a person who is downloading a lot of items, you can actually choose where you want your items to go. And then I think those are our main settings. So we are going to return back here. So again, what we did is came into the Opera browser. We selected the person icon. We selected settings. And then we went through startup, continue where I left off, notifications were turned off, suggested sites turned off, trending searches turned off. And then I believe that's all we did. But now when I come back to this homepage, there are no more of those ads. You do see some of these apps up here. Here's the best part about this. If I press and hold, I can delete these. Press and hold, delete these. Press and hold, delete. So it is as easy as customizing this on my own. So if I want Google to be up there, if I want my school website to be up there, let's see what else we can get. I'm going to add an address. We'll go to my um, demo folder on here. Once you have entered your site and named it, you are going to select there and now it's going to show up. So when I select centralinc.com, it's going to take me right to Central Inc. So these are called speed dials. This is kind of like you are creating your launch page. You will notice in the far right corner, there's a plus sign. When I select again, my next one, now I have 
my tabs that are saved. So just by changing those settings, we did not even have to create any sort of account. So just by selecting those settings next to guest, we know that it is customized.